So now we get into the sub a substitution reaction, and we're going to mainly focus on substitution of alkyl halides, uh, but we're going to see the substitution of, of other types of um, alkane, substituted alkanes. Now, in a substitution reaction, we said that a nucleophile substitutes for a leaving group, right? So we have a nucleophile and we have a leaving group. And we know that for with alkyl halides, the leaving group is the halide. So when we are when we're looking at um, an alkyl halide, the leaving group is the halide. Okay. Understand, we're going to see other types of leaving groups. So we're going to look at you know what makes a leaving group a good leaving group, how we can take um, certain types of groups and make them better leaving groups. And we're going to explore that throughout the chapter. We also have to understand there are many, many different types of nucleophiles. So this is going to lead to a whole bunch of um, reactions in which you get different products. But the whole gist of this uh, particular chapter is that there is a general reaction that takes place where you have a nucleophile that reacts with a substituted alkane um, where you have um, X is the leaving group. So with alkyl halides, X is a halide and, and the halide is a good leaving group. And you get a substitution reaction that produces this now leaving group, right? So oftentimes you'll see um, throughout uh, instead of X, you'll you'll see LG, and and I showed that to you um, at the very beginning of the this video series. So that's an important uh, concept to understand. Another important aspect of um, of the substitution reaction is that there are two main categories of substitution reactions. Uh, remember, I, I said previously we have an SN1 and an SN2 type of substitution reaction. So again, both of them have the same reaction scheme, but their kinetics are different. So there is a first order reaction, which is kinetics, and we'll talk about um, what that means uh, in just a little bit. Uh, and we're going to see that um, first order reactions, SN1 reactions, are common with tertiary substrates. So tertiary alkyl halides or, or other substrates where you have a good leaving group. We're also going to see another kinetically um, kinetic reaction that is called a second order kinetic reaction, which we see is common with primary substrates, so primary alkyl halides. Now, if you're thinking about the, ca the classification of alkyl halides, we have three main types of classifications. We have a primary alkyl halide, a secondary alkyl halide, and a tertiary alkyl halide. Notice the secondary uh, substrate I didn't list on here, and there's good reason for that. Secondary alkyl halides can take either one, and it depends on um, other factors that we're going to get into throughout the chapter. So the key is that you have to know how to classify an alkyl halide in order to predict the kinetics in order to predict the order of the reaction, whether it's going to be first order or second order. So, um, you know, I, I, if you have a weakness in um, classifying alkyl halides, this is something you're certainly going to need to practice.